uh, day 23 of the harvest log and uh, thought we'd have a quick look at the Redicop um, seed control unit whilst uh, the combine is just uh, parked up. Um, this is it, it does sit quite low down. Uh, this is the drive for the chopper, which is in there, the Redicop Mav, um, which takes its drive from the John Deere um, original chopper drive system. In here we have uh, tungsten coated uh, reversible blades um, and also on the very edge ones here we've got some paddles um, that increases the airflow um, to the outside part of the chopper which increases the, uh, the spread, the spread width um, and then sitting below the chopper uh, this is the seed control unit so this is the mill uh, there's two mills, one on either side. Um, the material that comes off the sieves drops into the mill on the other side. It's milled round. These are spinning at uh, somewhere in the region of 2,600, I think, revs per minute. Um, as it exits through that chute, um, it's blown up into the chopped straw um, and then is carried um, out into the field, the width of the header, um, by by that straw. Um, there should be um, some actuators just on the side here so that we can uh, move the two sides of the chopper um, up and down as required to sort of compensate for wind. Um, we haven't actually fitted them yet this year, we do have them, but um, at the moment we haven't really had a problem. It's chucking it uh, more than enough um, as it is in its sort of fixed position um, from some of the aerial footages. Uh, <clears throat> it's got really good, really good spread, really, really fine chop. Um, and um, yeah, this is it really. Uh, very few running issues, very few problems. Um, and yeah, really, uh, uh, really pleased with its results. And hopefully uh, that will be mirrored by the uh, results that NIAB will be delivering later on in terms of how our uh, weed kill is going.